Hey everybody, welcome back to another three minute English with Mitch video where I give you just some tips to help you speak English like a native English speaker. Today we're going to look at some grammar. Uh, this is something you may know or maybe you don't know. So let me tell you, this is when we're, we're talking about the future, when you're talking about the future, okay, oftentimes we use a verb uh, with ing, with another ing word, okay, uh, and you don't have to. Uh, but we often do, okay? So let me teach you what this means. What I'm saying is when you say, for example, you're planning to do something in the future, you're planning to do something in the future, or you hope to do something in the future, you could say, uh, I hope to go golfing tomorrow, right? I hope to go golfing tomorrow. Or you could also say, I'm hoping to go golfing tomorrow. Same meaning. Uh, I plan to go golfing tomorrow. I'm planning to. Okay, so I am, be verb, planning, ing, to go golfing tomorrow. It's the same. It's the same. You could just say, I plan to. You could say, I'm planning to. And in English, we go back and forth all the time, uh, you know, with the, in the future, when you're talking about the future. Most native English speakers often use the ing version. So if I'm going to a movie tonight, I would say, I'm planning to go to a movie tonight. I'm planning on going to the movie tonight. I wouldn't say I plan to go to the movie tonight. Most native speakers, we often say I'm planning to go see the movie tonight. Okay, so you can try it and try to use that. Let me give you some more examples. For example, I plan to study tonight. You could say that I plan to study tonight or I'm planning to study tonight. Same, same. Uh, I want to go to graduate school after college. Graduate school, de Aguan. I want to go to graduate school after college. Or I'm wanting to go to graduate school after college. I'm wanting to, I'm hoping to, uh, that kind of thing. I think I might go to the club this weekend. Yeah. Uh, I'm thinking I might go to the club this weekend. We often say that. I'm thinking I might go to the club, but I'm not sure. Okay. Same thing is I think I might go. I'm thinking I might go. It's the same, same, same. So I'm just teaching you that because you will probably hear many times native English speakers using the I am, the ing verb uh, version of that. So when you're talking about future plans and you can try it too. Try it out in the comment section below.